I don't, you know, I don't feel like it's. Uh, I'm not trying to sound. This sounds corny, but I don't feel like it's a goodbye. I appreciate it, and it'll be the end of the season, end of my small time back, and and I didn't have that because it was COVID before. But normally, when you leave a club, you don't have a big to rise manager. You know, you you're in one day and you're out the next, and that's fine. That's what I mean. It's an odd situation because you will. It doesn't be. feel yeah, but it doesn't feel that odd to me if I'm honest. I'll, I'll never. This is the corny part. I'll never feel like I'm saying goodbye to the fans because my career has been my career. You should be singing this. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, you, you won't want to hear that. But, but I no. But when I say, it, I mean, you know, my my career as a as a player and as a coach, the first time around in this period, you know, that's it's there. I live, you know, close enough to the stadium, and I'll be back at Chelsea many times. You know, and when you when you take on a managerial career, it doesn't mean that you're going to be at the, the club that you had 13 years as a player forever. So I'm quite um, um, uh, calm about that. I'm not, I'm not too nostalgic about it, but I certainly will appreciate. I certainly do appreciate the fan support, and I will appreciate it on Sunday. But more than anything, I'd love to give them a performance that they can take away to the summer and feel a bit more positive about. For sure.